I would like to talk about uh, hunting rifles and using them in uh, long range competitions, PRS matches, if it's even possible, can you do well. It's always uh, nice to have a dedicated uh, system that is built for what the, the purpose is, but uh, it costs a lot of money and uh, yeah, I can't afford it right now. So. Uh, I was looking for an interchangeable barrel system so I could go with one and two barrels for the training, shooting a lot and uh, switching to other calibers if I would go hunting. I ended up with this uh, Schulte conversion, it's a classic uh, DL action and here is a standard bolt and you can change out the magnum bolt, put it in and you can go from the standard calibers up to yeah, like 300 with 7 mm uh, it gives you a lot of choices but there are some drawbacks to uh, using a system like this this is a long action so uh, there is no chassis system I can choose this is a this is a stock from the KKC Focus here as we say it's uh, okay, uh, it's a pretty flat under, so it rides well on barricades. And you can uh, adjust it the way you like, so yeah, I'm uh, not having any trouble with it. But uh, standard magazines for the and Lotion is a uh, you know, six round magazine like this, takes uh, six standard cartridges like the 306, 6.555, which I'm using. It's, uh, Similar cartridge to the 6.5 Creedmoor. It has a little bit more case capacity, so maybe you can squeeze a little bit more out of it. But it's uh, in the same range. Uh, I have two barrels like this. One is I have in now is uh, my match barrel. It's the newest one, so I will use it, be using it for competitions coming this year. So um, I have a muscle break on Mirage, homemade Mirage cover. And uh, yeah, here is the trainer. I'm using it uh, last season competition, so now I'm switching it out. And uh, here is a, a hunting barrel. It's a seven millimeter Remington Magnum, so I use it for long, long range and uh, and for hunting. It's a nice caliber. When I bought this uh, just after it came on the market used, uh, another action is the same, shoot me to shoot some Larsen. So I uh, couldn't help myself and buy that for my girlfriend. So we have two similar actions and uh, this one is set up for fox hunting. So it's a short, very short 6.555 uh, barrel and a big silencer. So shooting small bullets fast to stop the, the fox, it's uh, a good one to so set them up for hunting, but uh, we are now talking about long range and PRS, so I would like to show you what I ended up doing to uh, keep up with the uh, pace in the PRS. If you ask someone that's training a lot, they say that changing magazine is no, not a problem, they just use second or two but uh, yeah, I shoot pretty much and I cannot say I agree because uh, it comes a lot uh, of things into play when you are changing a magazine. Of course I time it like if I have to shoot two maybe three rounds from one position and then I move I always uh, load them up so that I when I'm done shooting like maybe three shots from a position take out the magazine and uh, in with a new one but the problem is that you start thinking about the magazine change uh, in the last shot preparing mentally and it takes away a little bit of focus of course uh, training will help with this and I do that but uh, it's in the back of my head so I think that can throw the shot off if you, uh, if you are stressed and in a competition then you have to do the uh, magazine change itself. And I have to turn the rifle, take out the, uh, and put in the new one, maybe one, two seconds. And then you have to move 
back into the firing position it takes some seconds still so I believe a magazine change will throw you back anywhere from yeah, 3 seconds to 5-6 seconds depending on what situation you are in like uh, how difficult the barricade is so uh, what did I end up to doing yeah a lot of the matches here in Norway has been uh, adapted for uh, hunting rifles and uh, our own match here in Arjena, the Architraffer Challenge. We still have a mandatory magazine change uh, in almost all our stages so that the hunters can come, try out PRS and see if they like it and can use their hunting rifles. But uh, on many matches this is not the case, you just uh, have like uh, 9, 10, 12, 14, whatever shots and minimal time to do it. So I ended up with this pretty nice thing. <laughs> what is it? Yeah, I took one of the six round magazines and I. I Rain down uh, one of my like, three round magazines, something magazines, and yeah, used the epoxy, glue them together, and uh, fasten the inner spring to it. So, yeah, I will be trying to see if it worked now, it's just dried, so uh, I will be filling it up hopefully with nine, nine rounds and try to cycle it and we will see if it works and if it does yeah I'm one, one uh, step closer to having my uh, hunting rifle work even better as a PLS long range gun so, yeah. so I filled up the magazine it took nine rounds and uh, seems to go easy down there so we'll see if they come out just the same hope so here we go bastard nine rounds try it one more time nice 